Coloring Coloring is a term used to describe the act of adding color to something, typically through the use of paints, crayons, markers, or other coloring tools. In the context of the English language, coloring can also refer to the process of adding descriptive details or nuances to a story, statement, or description. Let's explore both meanings in more detail. 1. Coloring as adding color. When we talk about coloring as adding color, it usually involves filling in spaces or outlines with different hues to create a visually appealing image. This activity is often enjoyed by children as a form of creative expression or as a recreational pastime. Coloring can be done using various mediums, such as colored pencils, watercolors, or even digital tools. Here are a few examples of sentences using coloring. In this sense, the children spent the afternoon coloring pictures of animals. She enjoys coloring mandalas to relax and unwind. The artist used vibrant colors while coloring the landscape. 2. Coloring as adding descriptive details. In a broader sense, coloring can also refer to the act of adding descriptive details or nuances to a story, statement, or description. It involves providing additional context, emotions, or perspectives to enhance the understanding or impact of the message being conveyed. This type of coloring is often used to make writing more engaging, vivid, or expressive. Here are a few examples of sentences using coloring. In this sense, the author's use of vivid imagery beautifully colored the story. Her biased viewpoint colored her description of the event. The comedian's sarcastic tone colored his jokes, making them even funnier. In both cases, coloring involves adding something extra to enhance the original content. Whether it's adding color to a picture or adding descriptive details to a story, the goal is to make the final result more visually appealing or engaging.